Welcome back to Gaming Dugong. This is my pre recorded gameplay from mobile. And I'll fast forward this one. Uh, I play Mines. I think this was a ranked game, if I'm not wrong. There was a heartbeat, so I was hiding a bit there before I continue decoding the cipher machine. I turned off the position toggle, and I, it was a bad decision. Perhaps I will turn on the position toggle on the next video. So I skipped forward because I was searching for another cipher and trying to find out where the uh, hunter is. I actually discovered the hunter, but because uh, of the pre recorded save replay, I cannot see where the hunter is because I didn't turn on the position toggle. So I came here and touched the cypher machine a bit to make sure that there I wouldn't get any cross above my head and I decided to finish off this cypher actually no never mind I let the uh, mechanics duel to finish the cypher uh, the gunner is gone because uh, I think she was put on a rocket chair twice. She did try to kite a bit though. And we're down to one cypher now. This is like someone was decoding this one but they left. So I was making sure that the geisha is not here to haunt me. Uh, because Geisha can actually rush to where you are or if she has a persona to teleport, she can teleport to the cypher where you are. Geisha is a bit hard to kite sometimes, uh, but I did manage to kite a bit of Geisha with Mind's Eye. Not a lot though, uh, because she's very slow. Uh, I tend to hide a bit because sometimes the hunter can teleport to the exit gates and I let the mechanics to open the uh, exit gates instead. We're trying to wait uh, out if we can rescue the doctor but the geisha is coming so we decided to just run away. This is Joseph, uh, he's the photographer. He has a skill which can capture the moment. So if he if there is a flash like that, he captures where you are at that moment and he can catch you and slap you and put you on a rocket chair. If he just wanted you uh, or incapacitate you in the in the captured, you will be wounded in real life. But if he puts you on a rocket chair, you will be incapacitated in real life. So I was waiting a bit and running around a little bit to make sure that he's not around. Uh, I heard the sound that someone got slapped, uh, which is actually inside the captured moment, if you can see from the uh, right hand side of the mechanic. And the mechanic was put in a rocket chair. So I didn't know where he was. I couldn't see it with my tap tap skill because he is inside his uh, captured moment. And the postman was also incapacitated. And he suddenly appeared beside me, which I didn't know because I couldn't see him inside his captured moment. I was very sure he was trying to chase me. And that's why I waited for him to put a pallet on him. But he went to the uh, mechanic instead. I think because the mechanic was incapacitated so I ran away to the warehouse or some sort I suppose it is a warehouse uh, or machinery house and uh, I didn't finish the decoding here because I was afraid the hunter will come around inside and I went out to the other cipher and finished decoding on this one and I tap tap to make sure where the hunter is. As I said, I didn't turn on the position, so it didn't register in this video. Right. 
So the mechanic actually nobody actually saved her at the time, I think. Now, uh, jo Joseph actually captured me in this time, so he could probably see me inside the captured moment, and he did incapacitate me and put me on a rocket chair. But I managed to finish the cipher, so as soon as I finish the cipher, I know I will be incapacitated. Either wounded or incapacitated, so I try to find a place to hide first, just in case he come around. Uh, I think I managed to hide okay-ish here, because he didn't find me. And the first officer came, he was wounded as well. The postman is decoding this time, I suppose. Uh, and he's sending letter to people. It's his skill. So he said he has borrowed time. I mean, the first officer will say he has borrowed time, so I don't have to uh, heal him. But I decided to heal him instead, just in case the postman was caught or anything. And I think I made the right decision because then. The first officer will have a uh, full health to help the postman. I'll, I was trying to find another cipher around, uh, but I think Joseph went away, so the first officer could rescue the postman and finish decoding the last decoder. It was like maybe just a little bit left, so they all went to full health. Uh, but I think the hunter has detention. So detention is a skill where hunter has when the exit gate is open that the hunter can actually hit you and immediately incapacitated you, not just wounded you. So while I was decoding the exit, entering password on the exit gates, the postman got hit and immediately incapacitated instead of just wounded so uh, we were lingering around here a bit whether to rescue the postman but we didn't because we just like maybe it's good to just have a tie or anything so uh, on later scene you will see that the postman was nearby the dungeon I think he was hoping that he could run away from the dungeon if we both made it to the exit gates but Unfortunately, he got caught in a rocket chair, and yeah, so there goes the ending. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys on another video.